Nova is a family company. I started it based on my father's dreams. I'm so proud of the work we've done and the lives we have improved. But even with the strides we've made, I've struggled at times to explain the importance and the opportunity of the relationship between a person and his or her mobility device, their plus one. Then I saw a clip from the award-winning documentary series, Boys of Summer. It tells a story of a father who has Parkinson's disease and is struggling to accept the need to use assistive devices. And his son, who wants to preserve his dad's dignity and independence. Do you have your cane or your walker? I don't. Neither? Neither. Sure. Okay. Um, how was that? You're don't tell mom. What's that? Don't tell mom. Yeah. Well, I use them a lot around the house. I'm less inclined to use them out of the house because they're, they're cumbersome. You know, I've, I've talked before about how people trying to help me actually hurt me. They're trying to help me reach out and grab me. The natural, natural thing to do when they see I'm falling, it, it free, if people reach for me, it freezes me. And it's going to make my fall worse, or more likely. When I, when I went in for my last massage, I was coming out off the off the bed, and I had to a little bit. They were reaching for me, and I couldn't get them to get away from me. I couldn't get my feet, and this was good. It was feeding on itself. The biggest help I can see within that for education is the disconnect between you and your walker. I think when people see the walker, they're going to realize this is somebody that has something going on and is doing something about it. If you are not using that walker, people think this guy's in trouble. So I think if you want people to help to get out of your way, you got to make that walker part of you. Hey, it makes sense. I mean, I know you say it's cumbersome, but how cumbersome is a fall? Yeah. And you know you can't, it's not fair to ask other people not to, to go with their heart to help you. I do it and I know better. Yeah. So I'm going to put this back on you, Dad, and really make it a firm charge because I love you. You need to make that walker part of your life. Not up and down the hallway. Part of your life. You, you know, you've fallen a couple times since I've been home. And, the, you know, it's not that you can get 100% fall free, but that walker will, will, will significantly lessen your odds of falling and your commitment to it. I'm sorry, I hope I don't sound too harsh. No, I wouldn't say so. I appreciate it. But this is about stepping into the reality of, of where you are. Because when I see you with that walker, it, frankly, it makes me smile. I say, look at him go. You look, you look good with it. You look confident. You know? You can really make that thing a powerful part of you. One thing I wanted to talk about was your use of the walker, because you said on our walk this morning that you even kind of wondered why you had been so stubborn. It just seemed cumbersome to me. It seemed like a, a, a difficult piece of material to handle. It seemed like it got me attention that I didn't want. And how about now? I am very comfortable with it, and I'm not, not at all self-conscious with it. I haven't fallen in a long, long time. It's, it's like I say, I, I'm sorry I was as stubborn as I was. I, I, I gave myself an opportunity to hurt myself. To do that, being stubborn. Do you find that, that you're standing out less now? I'm just less aware of it. So you have to, and maybe you have a little bit, try to see yourself through other people's eyes and understand what, what normalcy actually looks like. The walker looks more normal than you trying to walk without it. Yeah. It looks safer. We've made great advances in how mobility devices function and how they look, helping people take ownership of them and their lives. I've seen people thrive, remembering who they are and that this mobility device can be both functional and stylish and even a sexy part of who they are. I look forward to helping you with your plus one and reuniting you with what matters most.